he is still over 50, but no longer out of work. A local man we profiled last week is now on the job with a little help from the problem solvers. K2's Carrie Tomlinson joins us now. And Carrie, the story was about how older people sometimes face discrimination when looking for work. Yes, it was. Rudy Lemus of Woodburn is 61, and he told us that one local business he was applying at told him he was, at his age, too set in his ways to train. Well, guess what? He is training right now at a company in Tigard. The president saw his story on K2 and brought him on board. Correct, yeah. We're going to meet the newest worker at Plastics Metals Technologies in Tigard. He's over here. The newest and also the oldest. Ultimately, he will be on this machine totally by himself. Starting driving trucks. Before, 61-year-old Rudy Lemus was losing hope. He's a grandfather raising two young grandchildren by himself. He lost his job as a truck driver last fall. They're going to see you as their grandfather. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's too old. And when I saw the story, something just hit that, you know, here's something that we may try something different. President Dick Allen hired Rudy for his experience and dedication. When I get so many young people through here, that third day in the work, can't get here on time and or don't show up or call in sick. Not this worker. Rudy used to be a truck driver. Now he's working with different kinds of machines. This one, a vacuum chamber. It's a new trade for him, but he's getting it down. Rudy, how's it going? All's going really good. His new trade, lining plastic medical equipment with metal. He will coat infusion pumps for hospitals. It's the pump that pumps the IV fluid, so you're saving people's lives. Yeah, well, yeah, I'm, I'm glad I, I can help somebody now. <laughs> I feel very uh, productive. I feel like I got a, a second chance in, uh, in, the, in the work field. Deep in my heart, uh, I appreciate it. You know. Now, Rudy is making pieces of medical equipment or working on pieces of medical equipment, and you can see the machines that he ends up putting together at your local hospital and on TV shows like Grey's Anatomy. Now, if you are still looking for a job yourself, we'd like to give you some information. The job search site LinkUp says the local companies with the most openings right now are Providence Health Services, Portland Community College, and Pacific Corp. Kiri Tomlinson, K2 News.